husband buys a drone to see if his wife is cheating and is left shocked when he sees what she's doing. Many people say that the secret to a strong and healthy marriage is trust. However, when things start to seem suspicious, it can often be hard to trust your partner. This is exactly what happened to John, a Pennsylvania man who suspected that something wasn't quite right in his marriage. Despite his better judgment, he decided to use a camera drone to follow his wife when she left for work one day. What he found when he watched the footage back shocked him beyond belief. John and Donna were a seemingly happy couple who lived together in a nice house in Hunsdale, Pennsylvania, and had been married for 18 years. They'd married young and had a family together, and for John, everything was perfect. He loved his wife, and although they'd argue or fall out from time to time, John had always thought that their marriage would last forever. However, after 18 years together, John started to think that maybe something wasn't quite right with Donna. John and Donna had a normal life. John worked from home and Donna had a job in the local area. Every day, Donna would head out to walk to work. Everything seemed the same as always, but suddenly Donna's behavior became quite suspicious. Sometimes she'd arrive home late after work and she seemed a little strange when John asked about it. Although he loved his wife, John couldn't help but feel suspicious. He tried not to think about the possibility of Donna having an affair but after a while, it got too much. John decided that he needed to know what Donna had been up to. He had a strong suspicion that she was seeing another man, but he didn't want to jump to any conclusions. He needed to find a way to confirm his suspicions without tipping Donna off. He knew that if he wrongly accused her, it would start a big fight. So John immediately thought about following Donna when she went to work. However, he didn't intend to follow her himself. John was a photographer by trade, so he knew a lot about recording equipment and surveillance. He had a lot of cameras at his disposal and knew he could use one of them to catch Donna in the act. He decided that the best idea would be to follow her with a recording drone when she went out to work. This way, she wouldn't suspect that anyone was following her and John could watch the footage from the drone at home without Donna suspecting anything. After thinking of his plan, John charged and prepared the drone, ready to follow Donna on her way to work. John felt a little guilty for being so sly, and he hoped that he was wrong about his suspicions. As Donna was getting ready for work that morning, John felt extremely nervous. He had a lump in his throat, and he really hoped that Donna wasn't cheating on him after all. He told himself that he was probably being overly suspicious, and that there would be a good explanation for Donna's weird behavior. As Donna left the driveway, John anxiously headed outside to get the drone into the air. He waited patiently to be sure that Donna wouldn't see the drone and then began flying it after her. John knew which way she walked to work and for a couple of minutes, it looked as though she was taking her normal route. However, after a few minutes, she made a turn and began walking in a different direction. John's heart sank. Had he been right? Was Donna on her way to meet another man? With bated breath, he continued to watch the drone footage. John was finding it hard to keep the drone in the air as he watched his wife walk towards an unknown location. He began to worry that he'd been wrong about Donna. Maybe she was just going to meet a co-worker, or maybe she'd found a different route to work. John really hoped that he was wrong and that Donna wasn't on her way to meet another man. He found it hard to believe that she would cheat on him after so many years together. Soon enough, Donna walked into an empty car park. Someone in a dark car was waiting for her. She let her hair down from a ponytail she was wearing and began brushing it. John started feeling very angry. John thought, is she brushing her hair? I don't know what she's doing. She's making sure her hair looks all nice for this person. John slowly started to realize that his worst fears were about to be confirmed. As Donna reached the car, any hopes that John had had were completely dashed. He watched in horror as his wife leaned down to the driver's seat window and kissed the man who was sitting inside. She then proceeded to walk around the car and sit in the passenger seat. As the car rolled out of the car park, John brought the drone back to his house. His heart was heavy and he felt a lot of anger towards the man. Who was he and how the hell could Donna do this? At first, all John could feel was sadness and anger. 
He was angry at Donna for betraying him like this. He was even angrier at the man for having an affair with his wife. John started to think about what he could do and how this news would affect his children. He knew he needed to tell Donna what he had seen, but he felt so angry with her that he wanted to take some time to calm down. He mulled things over over a couple of days whilst he decided the best course of action. Two days after John had caught her with a man, Donna returned home from work. John had finally worked up the courage to confront her, and he was furious. He wasn't sure how Donna would react to the confrontation. Would she be sorry? Would she try to lie or explain away the situation? By this point, John didn't care. He just wanted answers to all of the questions he had. He angrily told her what he had seen and demanded that she explain herself. When confronted, Donna immediately broke down. She didn't want to lie about what had happened. She simply began to cry. Donna was so guilty about what she'd done, she tried to explain what happened. She told John about the man, telling him that she'd only seen him a few times. She insisted that it was nothing serious and swore that she would end it. However, Donna's explanation simply wasn't good enough for John. He was heartbroken and didn't feel forgiving at all. John was so angry about the affair and after confronting Donna, he felt as though the relationship couldn't be repaired. After many fights and arguments, the couple finally decided that they couldn't go on like this. John didn't want to be with Donna anymore and he asked her to move out. With a heavy heart, Donna did as she was asked. Donna was just as heartbroken as John and she had already ended things with the other man. She really wanted to make things work, but John couldn't see past her betrayal. John accepted that Donna was sorry, but it just wasn't enough. John simply couldn't believe that Donna would cheat on him after everything they'd been through together. He felt as though he didn't know Donna anymore and having her around caused him too much pain. John was glad when Donna finally moved out and he felt that it was the best thing for both of them. He thought that not having Donna around would make him feel better and that it would help him get over the heartbreak. However, when Donna finally moved out, John still felt as though things weren't right. Although he thought that Donna leaving would help him to move on, he actually felt worse than ever. The house felt empty without Donna around, and John felt sad and alone. Although Donna had hurt him, part of him still missed having her around. After 18 years, he was used to having her with him and adjusting to life on his own was harder than he thought it would be. John still felt upset and angry about the affair, but deep down inside, he really wanted Donna back in his life. Although they'd been living apart, John still spoke to Donna, and he started to wonder if they could make things work between them. He decided to ask Donna if she wanted to move back in and see how things go. John felt as though he might be able to get over the affair and have a happy life with his wife. Donna also missed her life with her husband and was keen to give things another go. She had learned a lot from the experience and she was sorry that she'd ever started seeing the other man. When John asked her to move back in, she keenly accepted. She knew that things weren't going to be easy, but she was keen to try her best to reconcile with John. After all, he was her husband and she missed him and loved him a lot. Since Donna and John moved back in together, things have been going well for the couple. They're both happy in their relationship and they feel sure than ever that they want to be together. For Donna, the time apart was a stark reminder of how much she loved her husband and how important it was to be faithful to him. She regrets having an affair completely, but surprisingly, she has positive things to say about the way her husband caught her out. Although some people think that stalking your wife with a drone is an invasion of privacy, John and Donna are both glad that John did what he did. John says that following her with a drone actually saved their marriage. According to John, if he hadn't caught Donna when he did, things could have escalated with the other man, and this could have caused their marriage to be irreparable. Catching her with a drone meant that Donna had a chance to see what was really important before it was too late.